Hello everyone and welcome to Demolish and Build 3. This is the uh, the demo of the upcoming game. Today we're going to be doing a uh, garage demolition. So we're going to be destroying that for $500. And yeah, so that's our tasks and stuff. So let's get straight in and begin. Okay. Uh, let's go and have a look at the place first. So this is what we're going to be taking down today. Should be a fairly simple job, I reckon. It doesn't look like there's a lot going on. What's this? Uh, store all undamaged electronics. Demolish the garage doors. So yeah, it's just like a thing of what we need to do. Let's have a look inside. Okay, so we have some electrics to take off the walls. And then... Little bits and pieces. Let's turn off the power. I think we need to disconnect it from the main source as well. Okay. I think we need to turn off the power completely here. Which is what we've done. Alright, so there shouldn't be any power coming to this building anymore. So we can start by taking down the electrics. I think there's just a spot in the yard for these. Electronics here. Okay, let's put them all there then. This should be the electrics. Done. Demolish the garage doors and the walls. So, simple enough. Right, we can do this with jackhammer or sledge. I think sledge for the doors. Is that it? I don't think that's counted, has it? I think it wants us to kind of smash these completely. You know what? Let's jackhammer him. Yes. Oh no, 81%, but he's happy with 81%. So you can get away with doing not all of it. I mean, in real life, 
you're just going to shove these in, in a skip. It's sawdust. Okay, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Right, so now is demolish the walls and the roof, and then that is it for today's job. Right. I think if we just take out like the bottom foundation, the whole thing's just gonna drop and hopefully to destroy itself. That's one side of the wall about done, I think. I wonder what's holding some of this wall up. The, the strain on the roof must be immense. I'm interested to see what's going to happen here. So the whole building is just, at the moment, being held up by this corner. Okay, so this is where we test the physics. Now, quite how the house is standing anyway, I don't know. Bits are falling down. But uh, this is where we test the physics of this game. Because there is no way, really, that this place should still be standing. Because there is literally nothing... The only thing supporting it is this corner, and just... You know, the nuts and bolts of the roof. It is sagging slightly. There's that bit of the wall there, and that bit there, and this corner. They're the only things holding this whole structure up. So, when I get rid of this, you would think it should just collapse, really. Whether the interior wall is holding it. Ooh, it went a bit wobbly. Still holding somehow. I'm not entirely sure what is holding this building up now. It's trying to go. A wall has collapsed. I think the roof is kind of just holding everything up now, in a weird way. We can, um... We can the roof from the... the roof in stages now. Uh... It's funny how little things can just hold up such massive weight for so long. Alright, what's going to go there? Building pool! Thought he was going to go then. Let's take this corner out.
just that corner? Is that the only thing holding this full collapse now? We hurt ourselves there. We can go and heal ourselves. Look, we've got first aid in the back of our truck. <sighs> Which I think costs us a little bit of money, but... 72%. $50 for that. Okay. What was that, though? 90% on the doors. We're 55% of the way through. 43% on the roof. But the thing is down now. So it's just a case of just... Yeah, so the roof is acceptable, so it's literally just the walls now. Okay, it's dinged. Has it done? I think it's done. You can now end the job. Use the laptop in the back of your car to do so. So, uh, yeah, so you don't need to do the whole thing, which is good, because it would take a long time with a jackhammer. And I'll be honest with you, 20 minutes of listening to that jackhammer is enough to do your head in. So I think it'll be better when you get to the, uh, the later levels of things. You can actually knock it down properly. But for little jobs, it's not bad. But we've done a good job there. And it's only, what's this, 2, 2, 20, 2 at, the, uh, at the top of the game there. So we started like 6 a.m., so... Pretty good day's work. Not bad at all. So we can end the job there. Yeah, I'm happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that, to be honest. $500 job. I'd do that in real life. $500 for about eight hours work. That's pretty good. Okay, well, I think that is uh, that is the demo. Now that's going to do it for us then. That was Demolish and Build 3, the demo. As you can see, there, there are plenty of other things to unlock. So if you're into this type of game, this is the sort of thing that you'll be getting. If you've played the other titles as well, you already know about them. But you get all of, access to all sorts of these. You can bulldoze things, knock things down with wrecking balls, dig things, uh, build things as well of course because it is demolish and build it's not just about knocking things down but it's about rebuilding things as well and uh, putting things together so you'll have access to all of this within the full finished game at some point as well and uh, yeah I think that's going to do this video though so if you have enjoyed it make sure you leave it a like consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't already and I will see you for another video very soon